Hello, hello, Amy from Amethyst Hayes Adventures, live from Ketchikan. Not really live, I'm just recording from Ketchikan. But I wanted to come to you and release this video about two new dining options for lunch, brunch, that are being tested on the carnival spirit right now. So the first one is, and both of these were on the Tracy Arm Fjord Day because we are cruising um, Alaska right now. So it was on Saturday, we took off on Monday. So it was kind of like a sea day, but we are going into the Tracy Arm Fjord. So both of these were options were there. One is free and one is a pay option. I'll talk about the free option first. So it's called an open lunch seating. And they offered, um, you just went in, you checked in on the hub app, you could pick to sit with somebody or sit by yourself or sit with your group. And they offered four, um, four options. And I'll put the menu in here, um, but we had the a chicken Caesar salad, there was beef stew, there was a baked fish, and I got the breaded chicken with fries, and it was really good. Um, I'll actually even throw a picture of the um, breaded chicken that I had for lunch in here. And then you had three options for dessert, and one of them was a pineapple upside down cake, which is what I had, and it was fantastic. It was really good. Never had pineapple upside down cake, so I was going out and trying something new, which is, you know me, that's pretty shocking. And I really, really liked it. And so I'll throw in that menu and I'll show the pictures of the chicken and the um, pineapple upside down cake. Um, most of us had the chicken at the table. One person had the fish and she really liked it. Oh, and one guy had the chicken Caesar salad and he liked it, he enjoyed it. And I think we all had the pineapple upside down cake. Um, the time on the lunch open seating was 11.30 to 1, and you just, like I said, check in on the hub app. The second option is the pay option. And it is a steakhouse brunch, and it is $25 per person. And the times were from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. Oh, so for the seat for the steakhouse brunch, it is $25. Again, the time is from 10 to 1. You make your reservation on the Carnival Hub app, and yeah, so you pay through your sale and sign card, and you make that reservation. So starting off, you have four different starters that you can choose from. Um, a couple of them are waffles and wings. Sounds amazing. A lobster mac and cheese and an Alaskan crab shack bisque. And then there's two different salads that you can choose from. And then you have six entrees that you can choose from. And some of those are fish and chips, a prime beef burger and filet and eggs. And they also have a vegetarian dish on there, um, which I'm all right, sorry we were interrupted by some kind of announcement. All right, so there's also even a vegetarian dish that you can choose from, and I hear, um, I've been hearing a complaint that there's not a whole lot of vegetarian or vegan options, but they do offer a vegetarian option. Then you have five different sides you can choose from. Um, one of them is a spicy fry with a chipotle ketchup. Sounds interesting to me. And then you have six different desserts that you can choose from, or no, three different desserts that you can choose from. There's six different entrees, but you got three different desserts that you can choose from, and all of that is for $25, and I imagine you pick an app, a starter, an entree, and a dessert, and maybe you get a salad. Or you, you can pick the salad too, or that might be considered a um, part of the entree or the starter. I'm not real sure. But, like I said, two new options on uh, sea day lunch on the carnival spirit hopefully these will hit other ships i really enjoyed the lunch open seating it was nice to sit with other people and chat with them and for a smaller ship that doesn't have many lunch options those were a nice addition and something different um, to break up the limited options that are on the carnival spirit as far as lunch but that's my only really complaint about this ship and this size is there's not a whole lot of lunch options so it's nice to see that they are um, trying some new lunch options. 
on the ship and hopefully these hit um, the fleet here soon because I think they're a really good idea. Um, yeah, so, all right. Well, thank you for watching. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye, y'all.